I'm here at the International Federation of Red Cross headquarters in Geneva, and we have just finished a one-day, full one-day meeting with the deputies of the Interagency Standing Committee. This is a UN-mandated body of deputies that are tasked to support the principles the heads of the Interagency Standing Committee in coordinating humanitarian operations globally. And there were three main points of discussion. One was how we can roll out cash at the country level in very difficult crisis context that we are working on, whether it's in Afghanistan, Somalia, Syria, when you, we listen to the affected uh, population, what they really need is cash to take care of their families. It's part of the dignity. So we endorsed as a group a transition plan to scale up cash delivery as a response to humanitarian crisis. The second part of the discussion focused on protection how do we protect the people we serve from sexual exploitation, abuse, and harassment? How do we lead by example, by not abusing the people we serve? The third discussion, which was more internal, but again building on the collective efforts, we discussed a very heavy subject of racism and racial discrimination in our organization. But it was a very constructive discussion because it was about sharing lessons and practices of simple initiatives that are working from NGOs to different UN agencies on how to fight racism. The discussion was also about how we as leaders can demonstrate the values that fight racial discrimination in the organizations that we lead.